Hi, Liz here for the McKinney Courier Gazette with a preview of what you can expect in Sunday's paper. The word of the week is gasoline and the Texas Railroad Commissioner assured Texans there's plenty of gas to go around and more is definitely on its way. We also have two stories about how first responders and one McKinney-based company are doing their part to provide manpower and resources to rescue workers in Southeast Texas. Also, be sure to check out our page three profile about Chris Ackerman of the Mountain Man Beef Jerky, whose vendor booth is a regular site at McKinney's Farmer's Market. You can read these stories and more in Sunday's McKinney Courier Gazette and at courier-gazette.com. Courier Thanks for watching. Kenan Johnson coming to you once again, sports editor McKinney and Courier Gazette. We have a well-balanced paper this week as we have McKinney, Boyd, and North all represented. We'll represent the Lions by having a spotlight on the man who runs the show at McKinney High. Principal Alan R. Bobby will be our subject of our Sunday spotlight. Then we'll shift over to the gridiron where we have Boyd's first game on Thursday night and North's big highly anticipated matchup and season opener Friday at Post Stadium against Wiley. We'll also show the volleyball court a little love as we'll have a feature on the McKinney Lionettes as they've been one of the surprise teams in this area and look to turn things around after not making the playoffs last year. Keep it locked and loaded to StarLocalMedia.com for all things McKinney Sports and McKinney ISD.